we go. Razor set up right in the middle of their boot, which has a little bit of traffic, but making shit happen. That's how we roll. Here we go, we are attempting to put down the stencil. Scissors? Sorry? Scissors to cut. Scissors to cut. Stencil does one color. Okay. So you do one color. Oh, this is your company's logo? Yes. No, Jeff, I just want to hold both sides right here. You don't want it to touch the ground, all right? I'm going to make it touch the ground. So hold it right, right there, all right? Just hold it tight. I'm going to let it do it, all right? Usually what we do is we put it uh, four or five hundred grit okay. or eight hundred grit and then you polish afterwards a couple of steps okay. and then you put a sealer. So when you, when you put the color on it, you will still... Yes, you still, still polish to polish to make it even more shiny than that. You could, you could stop here if you want to, uh -huh. but it looks the floor looks nicer when it's, you can see like a perfect reflection like a mirror. Uh -huh. Come on this side. Uh -huh. yeah. uh -huh. Is uh, getting larger and larger as we speak. Uh, engulfed in uh, people everywhere. Can you give me a little cup of water? Water, a cup of water. My, my water bottle's on the table. Yeah, that water bottle will be good. Yeah, you can just bring the, just bring the bottle. Bring the bottle. Keep 
got here. Uh, just to kind of uh, rip, because it's a uh, glue, so you're trying to, uh, right, to, to, so it doesn't stick because we're going to peel it off, so you don't want the glue to stick on the floor, so it's going to separate, see, it makes it easier, yeah. Diamond tools, the concrete, the colors, the densifier, the sealers, everything. So, uh, that doesn't mean that of your company is similar. Uh, it's it's similar, but it's a little bit different. Yeah, ours is a colloidal silica uh, densifier. It's very user friendly. It goes on easy, and it doesn't no whitening. It doesn't turn white at all. You just uh, apply it, you let it dry, and then you go on your next grid. So, uh, is it is it necessary for polishing after applying the concrete density? Yes, it's it's good because it it closes the. Uh, Pores. It has a nanotechnology which gets into the concrete and seals the lower part of it. So it, it uh, closes the holes and it makes the sh uh, concrete shine much better at the end. I know that. Uh, so where are you from, America? Uh, I am from Florida, yes. Florida. America. Okay, so uh, I know that in America the square meter is not so uh, big, uh, but in China. Uh, Yes, you could just, if you're uh, pouring a new floor, you mean? Yes, when you're pouring a new floor, you want to use densifier, definitely. Yes, it helps. You, even, even when you don't polish, it's good to use densifier. It keeps the, like I said, it closes the pores and it, it kind of seals the concrete below the okay. pores and it stops the dust from coming up. Okay. So the floor will be, will be hardener? Yes, it hardens the floor. But how about the brighter? Uh, no problem, Your job you don't here polish it. To make it's sure, so what I'm going to do is when I yes. spray this, it's going to be over spray. Yes. That's why we did these. So I'm to make sure we don't get it on the other concrete. So I just need you to hold this board off. It's an extreme polishing. Sure. Yeah, exactly. Extreme polishing. Extreme polishing, yeah. Is this similar with extreme? It, extreme. It's called extreme polishing system. It's from Florida. I, I, I have. I remember I have contact. You have contacted us? Extreme. Yeah. Okay. okay. I have no idea yeah. States, it's uh, sixty-eight dollars per gallon. Sixty-eight dollars. Sixty-eight. Yeah, per gallon, and it, one gallon will do five hundred square feet. I 
是那种普通的那个油油油漆。Work razor? I'm ah, sorry. No. Yeah. We can do another coat of it. Yeah. Think it'll help? Probably. Won't hurt it. Let's do that before I peel it up. Yeah. We're going to do a second coat. Okay.